Uh, David, thanks for joining us. Uh, your match finished early enough yesterday for you to get away and see the Real Madrid-Barcelona uh -huh. match. I know you're a Valencia fan, but did you, uh, did you watch that big football match? I enjoy a lot uh, uh, watching uh, the match of, of yesterday. Of course, I am a Valencia fan, but uh, I like a lot the, uh, the sport football. Uh, in these moments in Spain, we have uh, a lot of great players. Now, not everybody may know this, but you're a big book reader. Mm -hmm. Tell me how many books you read in a typical month or year, and what uh, are your favourite types of books? Well, I don't know the, the number exactly how many books I can to, to read, but uh, always uh, I, I read books. Uh, I like a lot uh, Arturo Pérez Reverte. I like a lot uh, uh, Ken Follett. And now I am, I am reading uh, Patrick Rothfuss. And also you enjoy cycling, and, and I hear just to relax at the end of the tennis season, mm -hmm. you, you're going to go on a, a cycling tour. Can you talk about that? <laughs> well, uh, it's a, a really good uh, sport for to, for to do, and, and me, I, I like to, to do cycling with my, my friends of uh, Javier, my, my small village, and, and of course with, with my, my coach and, and physic trainer. It's good. I am uh, doing a really good season this this year. Maybe it's the the best of, of my career, and and I enjoy it a lot with uh, 30 years playing tennis. Yeah. I was going to say that that this probably is your best year. You've won five titles, mm -hmm. including three on different surfaces. Yeah. Uh, you have a 54 and 11 record. An amazing year. Yet it's still difficult to try and crack that top four. Uh, do, you, do you think about that much at all, or do you just focus on playing your best tennis and winning tournaments? I am, I am only focused uh, uh, trying to do my my best, uh, improve uh, every year my my game, and, and my goal is to stay uh, top ten. No? I think uh, uh, there are uh, the first uh, four players; they are uh, really impressive, really really good players, uh, and. It's difficult uh, to be uh, number four in, in, in these moments. No? They are uh, better than, than, than me and the, and the other ones. Mm -hmm. You turned 30 this year and there are a lot of guys over 30 doing so well on the ATP World Tour. Why do you think that is? Well, I don't know exactly why. I think I never had a really important injuries and I'm, my, I have a, a good uh, physique. I have a really good trainer, and and I think this that is the key because I am in a good moment. No, I I, I had never a really important injuries. Mm -hmm. You've had uh, a, you know a good success here at the U.S. Open, including a semi-final run. If I had to ask you for your most memorable match here, which would it be? I think when when I played in 2007 with uh, Rafael Nadal in. In, in fourth round, I think so, and I, I played a really good match. Mm -hmm. Do you have many memories of the US Open as a kid, watching it on television? Yes, well, I remember the matches of Andrea Agassi against Pete Sampras, Imal uh, uh, Nendel, uh, a lot of a lot of players. No, I, this tournament is is very important for the for the tennis players, and I have uh, really good memories when I was a kid. And look who we've got over our shoulder here, a good, uh, a good friend. I think we'll get you to, uh, to sign him later. Are you happy with the portrait? Do you like the way it looks? I like, I like. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, David. Thank you.